Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Sorry about my big old forehead and my hair. Um, I did just get off work. Uh, I'm on my way home now. Actually, I'm gonna stop and get something to eat. Dylan has already ate. He's off work today. Um, him and his dad have been pressure washing our house because we had never pressure washed it. Um, like before we moved in there or since we've moved in there and it was really really dirty so uh he's known that he's been needing to get that done but we haven't really had time um and he was off today so him and his dad have been spending time uh pressure washing the house and just focusing on getting the house the outside of the house clean um Life's been, <laughs> life's been life. Uh, since this whole pandemic has happened, things have just been really crazy. It's been really busy. Um, I apologize on behalf of myself and Dylan uh, for not being able to vlog as much. But to be 100% honest, we just haven't felt like our lives have been so interesting. Um because we haven't really been able to do anything. Uh, you know, everything was on lockdown for a while. A lot of things were closed for a while. Things opened back up, but now you like have to wear a mask pretty much everywhere you go, um, which I'm not complaining at work. It's mandatory for us to wear a mask, but it's just frustrating having to work nine, 10, sometimes 12 hour shifts with a mask on the whole time and then having to go out somewhere and wear a mask again. So we honestly have just been staying home. We haven't really been doing much at all. Um, so we just feel like our life hasn't been so entertaining and interesting to be able to vlog. Um, we really, really do want to pick back up vlogging soon, but um, we really do miss making videos for you guys and we really do want to uh, keep vlogging as well so uh, we're just trying to figure out like some things to do to make our channel more interesting whether it be like challenges or uh, like games or stuff like that um, so we're trying bear with us please because life is just hectic for everybody right now and there's so much unknown that it's just so crazy uh, every day is a new thing and yeah, so we apologize for being absent on our channel uh, every now and then, but we do want to start picking the vlog back up. So, um, yeah, I lost our tripod, uh, our little handheld tripod that we used to vlog. I have absolutely no idea where it's at. Uh, the last time I had it was the last time we put up a vlog. So it's been missing for quite some time. Uh, but this truck is flying. Um, but I'm holding y'all so you don't fall. Uh, good thing it wasn't very expensive. We can just pick up another one. We do want to work on getting a camera so the quality of our videos can be a lot better. Um, because they're not the best filming from my iPhone. What is this bus doing? Like, what's going on? doing but yeah so um i'm getting mcdonald's which is not good at all but the struggle is real and i just don't feel like cooking anything right now so and it's the closest thing to my house it's literally mcdonald's or bojangles that's the only freaking two fast food restaurants that are like directly by my house so um mcdonald's it is because i'm not in the mood for spicy chicken so i got at work these little guys right here this is not sponsored by scrub daddy by the way <laughs> never uh tried these before but these are the scrub daddy sponges um they are so freaking weird the names of them hang on let me order real quick and then i'll talk to you guys 
got these little scrub daddy sponges. One of them is a scrub daddy sour daddy. <laughs> the names are ridiculous. And then the other one is a scrub daddy sponge daddy. And they're just like really good sponges. Uh, I've heard a lot about them. We have so many customers that buy them. Hang on, stay put. Yes. Alright. Did you like the receipt? Um, no, thank you. Did you want a medium fries? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good one. So, yeah. Um, got these scrub daddy sponges to try them out. And then also, my job finally got name brand Germax in so I bought two of those and then we also got uh, some Lysol wipes or not Lysol wipes Lysol spray uh, so I bought those for my niece because she is starting school uh, within the next couple weeks and she's I don't know I think she's in kindergarten I'm pretty sure um, but of course they need like Lysol and Germax and everything like that so uh, I went ahead and got them that. Literally not busy at all. Like literally at all. And they took forever. Okay. Anyway. <laughs> um, so when I get home, I will um, show you guys a progress on the house. Dylan said they just have one side of the house and um, the back of the house to finish and then they will be done. Um, so I'll show you guys that when I get home. Hey guys, so Dylan and his dad are just about done um, with power washing the house. Um, I look like a mess. I just woke up from a little nap um, after getting home from work. Uh, I was so tired. I had to be up at 4.20 this morning. Um, so pretty exhausted, but they are almost done uh, with the house. So my hair is such a mess and I have these little like things flying to the side. I'm trying to debate if I want to cut my hair or not. Um, I get my hair done next Wednesday and I just, I'm so tired of it. <laughs> I just really want it to be short again. But then I know as soon as I cut it, I'm gonna be very like, upset because I'm gonna want it long again, but um, I don't really know what I'm gonna do. Uh, but I'm about to go check out the rest of the house. Um, Dylan came in the room to wake me up so uh, I can look at the rest of the house and see how the pressure washing is going. So yeah, I'm gonna go check that out and see how it looks. So I'll show you guys. so clean so this part right here I'm gonna try to talk a little loud um, just so you guys can hear but this whole section right here uh, was an add-on to the house that used to be just a regular screen and porch um, but we did close it in to make it our laundry room so that way our laundry room there's Dylan over there <laughs> um, we did close that in to make it our laundry room so that way um, we can have a laundry room because before the washer and dryer were in the kitchen and it was just taking up way too much room in there. Um, so we did close that in uh, with the help of my parents, Dylan's parents and uh, my aunt and uncle in New Jersey um, that we really got that room done. So I'm super excited about that. I don't think I actually have showed you guys the inside of that room. Um, I'm not gonna show you yet because I do want to clean it up a little bit and everything but um so this is the new siding right here and this was our old siding so it's super close uh to each other now y'all should have seen this before it was so yellow and gross and dirty and but yeah so that's the front of the house this is all part of our yard our land whatever um we have 1.6 acres, so we do have a lot of acreage. Um, all that over there is just a bunch of mess. We are gonna be getting it cleaned up here soon. Um, but yeah, so 
we think there was like a mobile home over there because there's like a little electric pole right there um and then we know there was a mobile home on the other side as well so this is the side of the laundry room and then the other side of the house i'm so glad my house is finally clean you guys don't understand how long i have been waiting um for my house to be pressure washed it's oh it's so good there's still like a little bit of dirty parts that dylan said he'll have to get on a ladder and kind of scrub um which is fine but this is all wooded area we are going to get rid of all of this and put a fence up so i am super excited about that y'all i wish i could have shown you guys i should have took a before <coughs> excuse me i wish you guys could have seen the before of this back the back of this house because it was absolutely disgusting like it was so dirty and disgusting and nasty um and i'm just so glad it's so clean i have a clean house i'm so excited um it's the little things when you're an adult uh but yeah so all of this was just so disgusting up there it was filled with so much dirt and debris and just everything i guess from the trees right there um so this is the back of the house it's pressure washed i'm so excited and then the they're doing the side over there right now but that's just more of our land um it actually extends past those trees um but we do have to get it uh like cleaned up and everything but all of this here is like poison ivy and poison oak so uh dylan has to go i think he's gonna do it on friday maybe he said um just go around and spray uh so that way we can prep to start cleaning up so uh yeah we're so excited we are going to be knocking down a bunch of these trees we're going to keep some of them so that way we still have a lot of uh what's it called shade around our house um i know we're definitely keeping that one tree right there because i love that tree so much um but we are going to be knocking down a lot of trees and getting rid of so much dirt and debris um so yeah that's our house yay this part is still um pretty bad and disgusting we have to go through and paint all that and redo all that um so we are going to do that so yay i will talk to you guys in a little bit uh, i'm gonna talk to my father-in-law and um finish checking out the rest of the house so be right back so i totally just realized that when i showed y'all this earlier i said sour daddy and it's definitely not sour daddy it's scour daddy <laughs> my bad error code on me um but i'm gonna try this out friday because i'm doing a deep clean on the house on friday um so I really want to scrub a dub dub, but I am using the sponge daddy to do my dishes right now. Um, so I'm gonna use this and I will do a review on it when I get done. Uh, I hope you guys like my eyelashes. They look very long. I got new mascara the other day. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try this out, see how it works, and I will be back with a review when the dishes are done. So just got the dishes done my stove is a little dirty um the <coughs> excuse me the sponge daddy was awesome it worked so well it worked so great um i'm gonna try the scour daddy now <coughs> excuse me all sorry um i edited this part out because he would kill me but Dylan is in the shower right now and he was just like singing so loud. <coughs> I really thought about leaving it in, but he would be so upset. Um, <coughs> gosh, sorry y'all. I was laughing so much. So. There's Stella. She's gotten so big. Hi, baby girl. Mama Misty. Hey. She's been such a bad girl. She literally has been chewing at my brand new rug and she knows <laughs> she knows she gets a little butt whooping uh when she does so like i said sponge daddy worked amazing so now i'm going to try the scour daddy on my stove um it has a little bit of uh food on it and everything so <clears throat> 
I am going to uh, clean that off, wipe that down, and cook dinner. So um, I will show you guys what I'm doing. I have um, <clears throat> I use this Easy Off uh, cleaner degreaser for my stove. Um, it works really, really well and I really like it a lot. So I use that. All the dishes are still here because Dylan dries. Um, so I'm going to spray this on there. I did go ahead and wet it. I don't know if we're supposed to, but I did anyway, just because I'm kind of weird about using dry sponges with cleaning tools. Okay, so I don't know if y'all can see, but there's some dirt in there, some nasty dirt. <clears throat> and this literally, sorry, this is literally getting it out. These things have not been cleaned in a while. <clears throat> I cannot believe these stains are coming out, y'all. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it makes me so excited. And it's literally, like, it's dirty, but it's not that dirty. But, oh my God. That is so awesome. Sweet. Okay, so I'm going to rinse this. <clears throat> oh my gosh. It's literally like a freaking magic eraser. What? <laughs> I'm so amazed with this thing, y'all. I really need to take this off and clean this. So I used to wear glasses all the time, and then I got contacts. <clears throat> and then um, I'm going to wash my hands real quick, uh, but still talk to you guys. So I used to wear uh, glasses all the time. And then I got contacts <clears throat> and I started wearing my contacts all the time. You can't really see my face. Um, I <laughs> lost my glasses for uh, literally like two months. And I didn't know where they were. I couldn't find them anywhere. Um, so, <clears throat> I didn't know where they were. Couldn't find them anywhere. They were in my beauty room the whole time. And I just <clears throat> didn't know. Uh, I thought I lost them, but they were literally in the room the entire time. So, my bad on me, but I'm wearing glasses because I don't feel like putting in my contacts. Um, my eyes have been really irritated lately. I've been using, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, I've been using a type of, <sighs> let me start over. <laughs> I've been using a type of makeup remover wipes uh, for my mascara that say waterproof, but it's not, like it doesn't really work well. Um, so I've literally been like scrubbing my eyes. So it hurts, my eyes are like really irritated. Um, so I'm so glad I found my glasses because I can give my eyes a break at least while I'm home. <clears throat> um, I don't really like to wear them going out because with the mask and everything, I don't like glasses being fogged up, so that's that. I did, bless you. <clears throat> we did get Stella a new fall color. Here she comes. I heard her name. Hey, baby girl. Hi, princess. This is yours. Yeah, that's yours. <clears throat> She's so cute, y'all, but so bad at the same time. Um, but we did get her a fall collar. It's so cute. It's black and orange and it has a little orange bow, um, for fall slash Halloween. So, 
Uh, we're super excited. And it says it glows in the dark too. Which, I don't, oh, is it the polka dots? It is the polka dots. The polka dots glow in the dark. That is so cute. How about have a new color next month, baby girl? She currently has like a summer-ish one on her now. Uh, it's like a summer vibes type one. Uh, it's really cute, but um, it was time for fall. Well, it's gonna be time for fall. We're decorating next month. Dylan doesn't know this, but I have plans to go to Hobby Lobby and get some fall decorations. <clears throat> I thought he was coming out. I have plans to go to Hobby Lobby and get some fall decorations <clears throat> uh, when they become 40% off. So, obviously I'm going to have to tell him because it's going to be in the video, but starting next month we are decorating for fall because fall is my all-time favorite season. My birthday is in October. I freaking love Halloween <laughs> and fall. So we are decorating next month. So starting September 1st, this will be on Little Miss Stelly Girl and we will start decorating. So <clears throat> I am going to uh, wait on Dylan to dry a little bit of the dishes. Actually, you know what? I won't wait on him. I'm gonna start on dinner because y'all like my little rat tail comb. <laughs> rat tail comb a little rat tail um it is five o'clock <clears throat> and i'm hungry so i'm gonna start on dinner in just a few and yeah dylan's probably just gonna make chicken and fries uh i'm gonna make a pasta stroganoff type thing um i usually put chicken in it but i'm not really feeling the chicken today so I'm just gonna make the pasta. It's really easy. I'll show you guys how it's done. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much it. Uh, <clears throat> I feel like my allergies are really bad. Yours are, cause you've been outside all day. Anyway, so. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and cook dinner and then watch some, well, we'll probably play some, can we play Mario Party? No. Yes! So we're gonna play some Mario Party and then uh, watch the new episode of Shark Week at 8 o'clock. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all I have for the vlog. Uh, we hope to start vlogging soon. Um, more often and obviously if we go places we'll vlog more often uh we'll probably have to get another tripod because like i said i did lose ours um but yeah so that's it that's all i got for you in today's vlog i hope you guys have a good rest of the week you want to say bye bye hang on let me <laughs> sure. um so yeah, hope you guys have a good rest of the week and stay safe. And we're gonna wait on Dylan to come say bye. Any day now. <clears throat> Do you know we got a dislike on our last video? Really? Yeah. No likes, but one dislike. I know. <laughs> I don't know why people would dislike literally just other people talking. Like, if you don't like the video, just click off of it. You know? Yeah. People are so rude. You coming? Yeah. Come on. Come on. <clears throat> So Dylan's here. <laughs> um, I brought Stella. No, he didn't. I was basically uh, just explaining to 
them how I'm going to be starting to decorate for fall next month. Oh, yeah? <laughs> and how I'm going to Hobby Lobby and buying some stuff for 40% off. <laughs> and uh, <clears throat> how Stella's been a bad girl and eating our rug. And look, her polka dots glow in the dark. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You can, look. you can look right here. <clears throat> you see him? No. Because you're not doing it right. You have to cup it and then look. Well, you can just go in a dark room. Whatever. Say bye to the vlog. Bye. <laughs> All right. So we will see you guys in the next vlog. Uh, don't forget, if you have any video suggestions or anything, leave them down below. Um, and we'll try to come up with some challenges and games for you guys. Here's Stella. She's kind of hard to see, but she's a little pain in the butt. Um, but yeah, so we will see you guys in the next vlog. Bye, see guys. Bye. Bye. All right, guys. So I am done with my pasta. I'm about to eat it now. Um, this is so easy to make. It's literally mushrooms, onions, spinach, chopped uh, with a little bit of olive oil and pink Himalayan salt. Um, and then you boil the pasta separately. And then when it becomes a little al dente, uh, then you just add it to the mushrooms, spinach, and onions. Uh, and then you add in ricotta cheese once you mix it all together. Not ricotta cheese, cottage cheese. Um, and I get the small curds one. This is really chicken stroganoff, but I didn't want chicken in it today. I just wanted the pasta um, because it's really, really good. So, uh, but literally you just cook the chicken in the same pan that you do the mushrooms, onions, and spinach. Uh, so you saute those first, push them to the side, and then cook the chicken on the other side, mix them together. When the pasta is done boiling, you add the pasta, mix it around, then you add the cottage cheese. So it's a super, super easy meal. Um, and it is so good and so yummy. Uh, but like I said, I didn't want chicken today. I did get this meal from Felicia Fitness uh, on Instagram. I will link her Instagram down below. Um, this is one of my favorite meals and it's a meal that Dylan likes as well. So I'm going to go eat this. We're going to play a little bit of Mario Party and then watch the new episode of Shark Week. So we'll see you guys later.